Did you know that there are over 2,000 species of starfish, each adapted to unique habitats from shallow tidal pools to the deepest ocean trenches? Starfish, or sea stars, are among the most iconic marine creatures, captivating scientists and ocean enthusiasts alike with their unique anatomy, resilience and ecological importance. These echinoderms, belonging to the class Asteroidea, inhabit oceans worldwide, from tropical coral reefs to the icy depths of polar waters. Join us as we dive into the captivating world of starfish, exploring their life cycle, their unique adaptations, and the challenges they face in an ever-changing ocean. Starfish reproduce primarily through external fertilization. During spawning events, females release thousands to millions of eggs into the water while males simultaneously release sperm. These events often coincide with environmental cues such as water temperature, moon phases or tides to maximize the chances of successful fertilization. Intriguingly, some species of starfish such as Acanthaster planchi, crown of thorn starfish, are known for their prolific spawning capabilities, producing up to 60 million eggs in a single season. Once fertilized, the eggs develop into free-swimming larvae called bipinaria. These microscopic larvae are planktonic, drifting with ocean currents and feeding on phytoplankton. As they grow, they transform into more complex brachiolaria larvae, which develop small arms and a rudimentary skeleton. During this stage, larvae are highly vulnerable, with predation and environmental factors significantly impacting their survival rates. However, their planktonic lifestyle allows them to disperse widely contributing to the genetic diversity of starfish populations. After several weeks to months in the planktonic stage, starfish larvae settle on a suitable substrate, often guided by chemical cues from the environment. Once anchored, they undergo a dramatic metamorphosis, transforming into juvenile starfish. This process involves significant anatomical changes, including the development of the iconic radial symmetry and the water vascular system a hallmark of echinoderms that enables locomotion, feeding and respiration. Juvenile starfish, typically measuring only a few millimeters, resemble miniature versions of their adult counterparts. During metamorphosis, starfish essentially reorganize their entire body plan. The transformation is so profound that it has been likened to starting life anew as many larval tissues are discarded and replaced by structures unique to the adult form. As juveniles, starfish begin feeding on algae, detritus and tiny invertebrates. Their diet diversifies as they grow with adults preying on bivalves such as clams and mussels. Starfish use their tube feet and remarkable feeding mechanism to pry open shells and avert their stomachs, digesting prey externally before pulling the nutrient-rich slurry back into their bodies. This feeding strategy highlights their role as keystone predators in marine ecosystems, helping control prey populations and maintain biodiversity. Starfish are renowned for their regenerative capabilities. They can regrow lost arms, and in some species, a severed arm can regenerate an entirely new starfish, provided it contains part of the central disc. This ability not only aids in recovery from predation, but also serves as a form of asexual reproduction in some species. Adult starfish typically have five arms, though some species can have as many as 50. Their arms are equipped with tube feet controlled by a hydraulic system, allowing them to move, adhere to surfaces, and manipulate objects. The central disc houses vital organs, including the mouth and digestive system, while their skin, often studded with spines, provides protection and aids in respiration. Interestingly, starfish lack a centralized brain. Instead, they rely on a nerve ring and radial nerve cords for coordination, making them an excellent example of decentralized biological systems. Depending on the species, starfish can live anywhere from 5 to 35 years. Some species, such as the sunflower starfish, can grow to nearly a meter in diameter, making them one of the largest echinoderms. Starfish have simple eye spots at the tips of their arms, capable of detecting light and dark. These primitive eyes help them navigate their surroundings and locate suitable habitats. Starfish circulate nutrients and oxygen using seawater, pumped through their water vascular system instead of blood. While they may seem slow, starfish can move relatively quickly, with some species capable of traveling up to two meters per minute. 
Starfish are far more than just beautiful inhabitants of the ocean floor. They are keystone species playing a crucial role in maintaining the health and balance of marine ecosystems. As predators, starfish help to regulate the populations of their prey. Their feeding activities prevent any one species from becoming too dominant, ensuring that resources are shared among the diverse members of the marine community. For example, starfish help control populations of mussels, which are strong competitors for space and resources. Without starfish, mussels can outcompete other species, leading to a decline in biodiversity. Starfish also play a role in nutrient cycling. Their waste products provide nutrients for other organisms, and their bodies, when they die, contribute to the organic matter that supports the marine food web. Despite their resilience and adaptability, starfish populations around the world are facing an array of threats, many of them linked to human activities. Pollution, climate change and disease outbreaks are taking a toll on these iconic marine creatures. One of the most pressing threats is sea star wasting syndrome, a devastating disease that has caused mass die-offs of starfish populations along the Pacific coast of North America. The disease, characterized by lesions, tissue decay and ultimately death, has had a profound impact on marine ecosystems, highlighting the interconnectedness of life in our oceans. Climate change with its associated ocean warming, acidification and changes in currents poses another significant challenge to starfish. These changes can disrupt their reproductive cycles, reduce food availability and increase their susceptibility to disease. The future of starfish, like that of so many marine creatures, depends on our actions, reducing pollution or mitigating climate change. By understanding the life of starfish, we not only appreciate their beauty and ecological significance, but also gain insights into the broader challenges faced by marine biodiversity in an ever-changing world. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share to help spread awareness about the urgent need to protect our precious marine life. See you next time.